An alleged plot to beat and paralyze an ex-boyfriend of hers has landed an East Aurora woman in federal custody. Now, prosecutors say that woman went to the dark web and sought help on a murder for hire website. Channel 2's Jeff Preval is here with details on this. It's a bizarre. It absolutely is, Mary Alice. In this case, investigators tell us that the ex-boyfriend is safe and was told about the alleged plot. Meantime, that East Aurora woman will spend at least the next couple of weeks behind bars. 47-year-old Yen Yen Lesser is in custody of the U.S. Marshals. We weren't able to get a picture of her because cameras are not allowed in federal court. Prosecutors say last month, Lesser went on a murder for hire website on the dark web and paid someone $7,000 in Bitcoin to paralyze her ex-boyfriend in Florida. Investigators say one of the notes that Lesser wrote on that website was, quote, I will add 2,500 more to cover the cost of beating, crippling, and robbery look like job. She searches for that specific service, which is outlined, you know, resulted in the charges, and she finds some suitors and then she picks like anything else, like you would on Google, you pick who you think responded to your needs appropriately. Now, who the alleged hitman is remains under investigation. Authorities are looking into that. Prosecutors say they have cell phone and bank records against Lesser in this case. A detention hearing has been set a couple weeks from now. We tried to reach Lesser's defense attorney for comment, but did not hear back. Reporting live, I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.